I think the ride quality on this mode is actually really good. They haven't stuck it on stupidly large wheels. It's on uh, quite big rubber, so it actually, it actually rides really well. I quite enjoyed how it handles. I think it's, it's quite premium in that regard and not, not really thin rubber profile tires. So I think I was most impressed by that. I think they've really uh, put something that catches your eye. You, you want to look at it when it passes. I think for an SUV, it's surprisingly sporty. The steering system is very interesting. It's electrically assisted. I like the fact that you can also change the weight of it with sport setting. And the engine, you can see it's quite an old school turbocharger engine. It works fairly well with the CVT, fairly refined for its class. The biggest thing that differentiates it from its other counterparts is the look. Other competitors don't have that sneak looking futuristic design. So I think it stands a good chance based solely based off of that. The car looks quite good, um, something unique. The rear I'm not too sure about, but the front is where my, my party piece is. Um, it looks quite good in front. The grill, the LED lights, the whole interior is quite quite unique, quite futuristic. I like the, the step that Omoda took. You can tell that this is a more premium brand than its other siblings. Chinese brands at the moment are, are quite hot and I think it's it's time to test the waters with a premium brand to see if people will go for a premium Chinese brand or, or whether it's just the, the enticing pricing that's been bringing lots of buyers to the Chinese cars. Compared to the Cherry brands, the Cherry SUVs are a bit more conservative, conventional. It's used to this sets it apart quite nicely. Putting it under a different name under the Amodo badge will also give it quite a bit of edge in the market. I think the spec is very competitive. It's very comprehensive. Anyone who's going to get into this car is going to feel like they've got a full SUV package and I think that's what's going to give it a very good edge in the market.